If there's one thing I love in this life, it's holding grudges, but I think it's finally time that I move on from my tumultuous past and put these demons to rest. And by that, I mean I'm gonna tuck them in nice and tight so they can have a good snooze and wake up stronger and harder to defeat next time. If you don't know the lore, I have had two people very close and dear to my heart who have had kind of an interesting cycle of relationships with me. Their names are Phoebe and Ione, and I have been pretty pissed off lately. I have been making snide comments, I have been angry in general, and he's gonna make me angrier. I swear to God, it's time. You know what? It's time that we be calm. He's been lurking on my island for weeks. He seems to be obsessed with like the scent of the island or something. He's just walking around absolutely dazed and confused and I don't know if it's from the weed or from the fact that he is insane, but we'll see. Ioni is very recent. Ioni is a problem that has recently resolved itself, so I am very hurt by this. I'm still very raw and I'm still very in this, so I think it's time for me to kind of give myself a healing exercise and I'm gonna make her and Phoebe a home together so that they can be far away from me and I don't have to think about or deal with them anymore. They will be together and happy and I will be free and happy. It's like seeing a really bad aunt who you hate and then saying, hey, can you go outside and get something for me and locking the door. I will be locking the door on Phoebe and Ione out of my brain and that way I can have my snide comments in peace, all right? I want to go to work. I'm not trying to make an ugly revenge house here. I'm really not. I'm trying to make something beautiful so they don't want to leave and they just kind of get isolated from society. That's more what I'm hoping. And I feel like, you know, I know them pretty well, so I'm the person to do it, right? I know both of them super extremely well and they are all memories that I will never be able to forget, so that's great. Hi Nico. Let's show today who's boss. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do that. Nico, not now. The man just gave me some pillars and island counter recipes, so that's great. I mean, I guess I can use them. I guess that will be very helpful, but I also was interrupted and I feel very mad about that, but whatever. Oh my god, we have quite the assortment here today. Hello, Sandy. Buzz, we get it. We understand. You don't have to sit there doing that. We understand. Look at him. He's trying to convey some sort of message, but I refuse to read it. In this situation, I simply cannot see it. Oh my god. He's definitely put here for witness protection even though he was involved in the crime. Like, we all know it. We all understand. He's feigning innocence. He's not doing a good job. Anybody with a brain can see that he's not doing a good job. Sheldon, turn yourself in. I would never say that to anybody else, but turn yourself in. Ugh. Renee, you're kind of failing me today. Why would you do that? Anyway, the good thing is I'm not here to see any of you. Even though jitters, I am interested to know what kind of crack house you're wanting. I am here to call in a favor. I really am. I haven't made a roommate's house before via Amiibo, so this is going to be a little bit of a learning process for everybody. You got anything good? That tub is really cute. I might buy that later. I don't know. Wardell, sweetie, look away. I'm about to be a bitch. Okay, I don't want to make the hospital right now. I really don't want to make the hospital. God damn it. Be right back. You know, the fact that I was just forced to build a hospital kind of feels like a threat. I feel like I've made a dire mistake here, but it's fine. Hopefully we won't need it. Hopefully it's just actually a little bit of a coincidence and I'm gonna be fine. I didn't want to do that in the first place, Lottie. I'm sorry I really didn't, but let's do this. Let's actually get to it. None of these people know anything about me. I've tried to keep my personal life away from work. We're gonna be keeping this a little bit under wraps, you know, Lottie? We get it? You get it. I'm sorry. I feel bad. I don't know who I should start with. I know you have to start with somebody. I guess I'll start with Phoebe. I think I need a little bit of preparation, kind of like bringing it up, like starting on a low dose of a medication because I am sure about to get some side effects. Ooh, that's a horrible sight. It feels like seeing a text from somebody you really don't want to see a text from. Ready or not, you've reached Phoebe. So yeah, hey. So we're starting off like that, I see. All right, that's great. Thank you. Thank you for being honest with me for once, Phoebe. I really appreciate it. I'm not ready, actually. I'm really not. I'm looking for closure. I'm sure you don't need it, though. You seem to be already pretty closed off. You called me to tell me you want to build me a vacation home? Uh-huh, sure. What's the catch? There's no catch. There's no catch at all. In fact, I want you out of my life. This is the least catchy thing I'll ever do. All right? You better not expect it again. Whatever. It's not like I'm busy. Okay, where's this totally real vacation home thing gonna be, Sparky? At your mom's house? Look at this. Look. It's like when our dates would always get third-wheeled by Ioni. Except this time it's Lottie, who I also flirted with, but that's a different situation. Actually, no, it's not. Phoebe, you want to hear about it? You want to know exactly? what happened. I'm sure you don't. I know this is kind of out there, but here's what I'm thinking for my vacation home. I don't care. This is going to be for you and Ione. All right. Look, fire. Of course. Fire. She wants me to burn. I'm going to be a burn victim. All right. That's great. That's why we needed the hospital, I guess, but better safe than sorry. You know, I heard a song the other day called Burn Victim that my friend got on their Spotify Discover Weekly. Thank you, Vicky. It was the most deeply insane song I've ever heard. Like, I have never heard anything like it. And I've been listening to it more. It's insane. I don't know why I like it. I don't actually like it, but I like 
like it. You know what I mean? I can't say the name of the band on this channel because I'll get demonetized. That's kind of pretty. I feel like this would work good for both of them. I can't believe I'm doing this. Wow, that spot's awesome. This is gonna rule, Sparky. Oh, suddenly you're excited when I'm doing something for you. Suddenly you trust me. You think this is gonna go great. Okay, two levels. We're being so civil and nice right now. It's like we've never even had a history. Oh, she runs ahead of me, of course, because she always puts her needs ahead of mine. Don't be that close to me, all right? Okay, we're gonna really just do the bare minimum here because I'm gonna need to invite Ioni over. Wow, you like your house, Phoebe? Isn't that great? All she wanted was fire shit. You don't even get the chance to burn me alive, bestie. I need witnesses. I'm gonna go. It probably really looks like I'm being a bitch to her right now. I swear, we're coming back. This isn't gonna be the final project. I just don't wanna spend too much time on her original home. Thanks for everything. Vacation home life is gonna be sweet. So, got any plans after this? No, I do not. I am going home. Leave me the fuck alone. I'm not coming over. All right, try it. Try it, really. I expect you to show up with flowers to my house if you want to apologize. That's not gonna cut it. I don't think so. Okay, how do I do the roommates thing? <laughs> I really should have prepared better. Oh my god, I have to do this. I get that you all are trying to stop me, I swear. I swear, I'm being normal about this. I'm being so normal, Wardell. I don't need some calming meditation. I'm good. I'm really fine. This is for me to be calm. This is my calming meditation. I'm letting go. I'm gonna sob. He's so fucking cute. He's almost making me want to be a better person. Almost. I'm back after my forced break. You never hear about getting a forced break in jobs, do you? This is kind of nice. This is exciting. They're actually, like, obeying labor laws unlike somebody else we know. I never said I wanted to stop working. I really have something in mind here, Lottie. I need you to trust me. It's really normal. It's normal shit. I promise you I'm being normal today. Do I have to visit? Let's talk roommates. There we go. Ah, roommate, I had a feeling that would come up. All right, we'll see how it goes. What's next? Are you kidding me? She is so rude. Leave it all to me. Just so long as I can meet him first, all right? I trust you, Sparky. Great. Right, you want me to bark like a dog? You're still calling me Sparky? Are you fucking kidding me? I won't. I would have back then, but I won't now. Okay, how do I do this? Find a roommate for Phoebe. Yeah, I have somebody in mind. I know somebody. Should I use an amiibo to find a roommate for Phoebe? Yeah. Let's talk to her. Let's see what's going on here. She's obviously going to be nicer. I think she feels bad. I really do. I honestly think she has a little bit of remorse in her heart, but I'm not going to deal with that. Oh my god, she's so cute. I miss her. It's not like that. It's not like that. I don't miss her. I don't miss somebody who didn't like me, but I do miss looking at her and her cute little heart nose. I miss that. All right, you're never fully going to get over somebody who you think is super cute. Someone's looking for a roommate, huh? I've been thinking about finding one, so let's do it. See you soon. You've been thinking about finding one, huh? <laughs> You know, you had one. I'm just saying, you had one. You had one totally available. And yet, now you're thinking about finding someone. Look at them. Look at the way she looks at Phoebe. Can you believe this? It's so nice to meet up like this, Phoebe. You remember each other? For more context, I feared that they were both together on my island, and I'm pretty sure the thing that I thought was going on with the throuble was actually them being into each other more than they were into me, but whatever, it's fine. It seems like the two of you are already getting along really well, so do you think you want to give moving in together a try? I didn't think we clicked this well, but here we are. Can you believe this? I wasn't making shit up. I wasn't making shit up. Look at them. You know what? Maybe it wasn't really about catharsis. Maybe it wasn't really about letting go. It was proving my theories because I just proved my theories. I just proved them right there. With that one little shot, everything was fixed. I know what I'm doing now. Mm-hmm. Yep. Great. Ugh. Yep, yeah, I sure did set it up. Mm -hmm. It's not like you two have been like this the whole time. Okay, I think I'll start with the outside of the house. I need a good way to combine two aesthetics together because they're two pretty different aesthetics. I feel like that crimson shade is really nice. I feel like that would work good. Maybe something like this to go with a little bit more of the chic aesthetic that Ioni has while keeping it funky. I'll do the exterior actual decorating when I feel like I have more of an idea of what's gonna go on inside. I'm so serious. I'm gonna be so good at this, I promise. I'll even call on the memories we have together to think of what they might like, you know? I don't give a shit about soundscapes. All you're gonna be hearing from me is bitchiness, okay? Who the hell is driving by my house in a goddamn Mack truck? Can you shut up? I'm having a little bit of a crisis here. I need to be left alone. This is something that I don't appreciate. I don't like this. Ugly. No. I mean, it's not ugly, but it's kind of ugly, if you know what I mean. Hmm. What the fuck is this? I've never seen that in my life. Is somebody out here trying to blend in with Drift? Is this where Drift wants to be buried and cremated? That is horrifying to me. That is his skin. This is the skin of a killer, Bella, except it's not. It's the skin of Drift. It's crazy, because I always kind of thought I would be designing a home for me and Ioni. It could have worked out. I mean, it never was gonna, but, you know? Yeah. 
Oh, it's fucking ugly. Actually, I feel like this might suit both of them pretty well. It's got a good vibe of like seeing the nighttime sky like Ioni likes and like we used to stargaze together, but it's also got a bit of that darkness for Phoebe. That's so not Phoebe. Oh, gross. I remember like going shopping for my room with her and she would have hated that, so. Something like this is perfect for Phoebe. I redid her house at one point and I actually put this in there. <laughs> yeah, she still has that house. She still lives there. I've seen pictures of it on Instagram and shit and she expects me to look at it and not feel any kind of vitriol. And maybe I'm getting better at that or maybe I'll die unhappy. We don't know. Maybe some red lights. Colors do we have here? Do we have red of this? That's so nice, isn't it? I look stupid. I hate that. I really just despise that, unfortunately. That's the wrong shade of red. That's the problem. Hi, Ioni. Yeah, I see you. She's just watching me. She's thinking. She's having so many thoughts right now. I would love to know what they are. What about wall shit? What about shit that you put on the walls? I have no wall decor in my house, and it's kind of like making me a little bit furious. I don't know where to get good wall decor. I've tried painting things and stuff for myself, but like I feel like it never turns out good enough to display, and then it just looks stupid. Ooh. A red TV would look so good right there. And I know this comes in red because <laughs> I regret doing her house so much. I really do. I think I made a big mistake there. That's gonna haunt me. Actually, I feel like I'm gonna rework this a little bit. I'm not the biggest fan of that. I want the living room to be a little bit more spacious instead of just like a corner. You know what's crazy? This isn't related at all, like even in the slightest. This is a completely different topic change while I design. I was looking on walmart.com for Christmas gifts. They have easy bake ovens, right? And I was like, that's so cute. I haven't had an easy bake oven since I was little. That's adorable. I would love to know what an easy bake oven is like now. I click on it. It's 180 goddamn dollars for an easy bake oven. You could get a microwave for less than that. You could get one of those little toaster ovens for less than that. Are you fucking kidding me? For an easy bake oven. Who is expected to have that kind of money? What person would have that much money for an easy bake oven? Nobody. Mm. I don't know if I like that as a TV stand. No, we're not gonna do that. I don't know. I swear kids' toys used to have like an affordable price on them, but like so did everything. Everything used to be more affordable, but whatever. I'm getting old is the problem, I think. I think I'm actually getting extremely, extremely old and I have like butt minutes left, unfortunately. I don't know. I feel like I need to watch more House Hunters. This is embarrassing. I used to be so much more into House Hunters than I am now. I really want to watch Cheap Old Houses because it looks really good. Have any of you guys watched Cheap Old Houses? If I could get a goddamn house for cheap, you'd never see me again. I would be happy. I would be able to stop taking any kind of antidepressants. It would be fantastic. You'd never see it come in. Oh shit. Okay. That might work. Phoebe, look how nice this is, right? I actually kind of hate the red coffee table. I feel like it should be black. Why do I feel like it looks stupid? That looks kind of stupid to me, in my opinion. What if I didn't do that? And I did that. Okay, that feels a little bit better. But then again, I don't know what I'm going to do. Should I do like a corner nook? I don't know. This is just hell for me. Honestly, look at them. They're judging me down there. They're thinking, hmm, yeah. Is that why we broke up with them? Is that why we don't want to be with them anymore? Because they can't design a fucking house? Oh no, I should not be talking like this. This is cathartic. This is healing. This is not what I'm supposed to be doing here. A couch would make me feel better. A good Ikea couch heals all. I miss Ikea so much. It's not even fucking funny. I would give anything for Ikea. At least there's a black. At least the emos are represented in one way. I feel like Ikea is where I should have been raised. I feel like I should have spawned in an Ikea and lived there for the rest of my life until I was old enough to work a job. I feel like that's where the enrichment for me should have been. The categories are so confusing to me on this goddamn game. Where is everything? I wouldn't know what a houseware is. I don't have a house. Why is there only one stereo that like sits up like that? I want one that sits up like that, but the lily doesn't really match. There's really no red tension pull rack. I see how it is. Hilarious. All y'all have is cherry wood. Are you insane? Are you deeply insane? Who the hell is wanting cherry wood at this point in time? Ah, the old acoustic guitar. You remember that? Do you remember playing it? I remember when you played it. I remember putting it in your house. I'm glad you brought it with. It's good to see this. This has such great memories attached to it, Phoebe. Thank you. I don't know what kind of table I want to use. I'm just pissed off at this point. This was a bad idea. I knew it. I knew it. I should have listened to my gut, but whatever. It's fine. My gut's wrong half of the time. I have IBS. That's pretty perfect, I would say. I think we're gonna need some notes of blue as well here because there's not enough blue It's not like I brought that from home or anything like it's totally not It's not like I put it there to just remind Phoebe that I do have her photo and she didn't take it when she left So you know I thought I'd bring it out of my own little personal touch to this place because it needs that it really does It needs a little bit of Ioni in it and I'll add that you know what I'll be the good ex and add it that's the wrong shade of blue and it's making me really mad. Okay, you know what? Whatever, it's fine. Is there a better shade of blue with this? Or not really? Okay. We can add a note of Ioni too with this little star clock. How cute. 
it's really just good to add in those elements, those really personal deep elements. It's how to be the best designer you possibly can be. Be an absolute cunt all the time. I like that better than the records. You're just gonna have to store your records somewhere else, Phoebe, I don't care. I wish I had the marble pillars unlocked, that would be so helpful. Can I do two? Would that look better? Yeah, massively, actually. See, that doesn't look horrifically weird, does it? I don't know, I'm trying to do a fun little HGTV island here. I'm really trying to fuck around and find out. Oh my god, this is exhausting. How do you do this? How do you sit here and play Happy Home Designer? I used to do that in 2020, but I think I'm just like too mentally ill for it at this point, which is fine. This is making me so mad, okay. Wait, hear me out. I really should have planned this out. You know, most people like plan out what they do before they do it. That's a crazy thought to me. It couldn't be me. It really could not be me. Wow. I really wish I had black. <laughs> Look at this. Okay, now we need some kitchen supplies. We need somewhere for them to cook. This is gonna have to be edited down so badly. I just talk like there's something going on at all times. There's fucking not. So is Wednesday actually any good? I have not watched it yet because I just don't feel like opening up Netflix. That's so much effort. Let me know what you think of it. Is it actually worth all the hype? Because I feel like half of the shit I've watched on Netflix that was super hyped up was not worth it. But what did you think about Wednesday? Because I loved The Addams Family as a kid. I still do. I still do love The Addams Family. It's one of my favorite little properties. One of my favorite little shits ever. So I would really like to enjoy Wednesday. Wednesday if it's like good but I'm scared it's not and then when something's not good it just ruins everything else for me because I just can't get over shit ever are you seeing this I'm just saying like are you aware did you know did you know about this it looks so good right we could do a blue fridge are there blue fridges I feel like I know nothing about the animal crossing fridge sphere well no it kind of matches it's kind of okay maybe this is like tetris this is fucking tetris i hate it here i have always wanted to design my own kitchen that is my goal in life is to have a nice funny little kitchen that i can tour and show people kitchens are everything to me i'm not even the biggest cooking fan but like if you give me a kitchen oh shit oh shit i'm gone you want to sit in the kitchen you can just stand in the kitchen boom healed unless you're like forced to cook for people then it's extremely stressful and i really don't want to do that i don't want to see the stress of that Imagine drinking milk. I'm just saying, like, imagine it. Imagine thinking drinking milk is what you want to do with your life. You sit down and you're going to spend your life drinking milk. You okay? Like, do you want to talk about it? I mean, I don't want to talk about it with you. I don't want to talk about milk ever. But there's definitely somebody out there who would talk to you about it, I'm sure. Like a therapist. And then we'll do accents of red as well. Crazy, right? Crazy. This is so crazy of me. I think I'm insane. I think the problem is I've just always been insane, I think, actually. So we'll deal with that in the future, I guess. Is there not more kitchen shit? I feel like there should be more kitchen shit. There should be kitchen shit everywhere. There's no red dispenser. There's no red little soap dispenser. That's sickening. Have you ever thought about that? The red soap dispenser is left out. The red soap dispenser is gonna die alone and unhappy. You ever think about that? It's really very sad. I think that that's a very sad life for it to live. And honestly, I'm not ready to deal with that. I'm not ready to let it happen. I think that there should be a red dispenser. There's too much light in life waiting for that red dispenser. Red tea set blue mat. That is God tier right there. Look at how happy they are. Do you think they know that they're being like pwned right now? Do you think they know that this is all for my gain? I hope they don't, but at the same time, I hope they do. I hope they go home and they realize what has happened. I don't have any nice kitchen mats. That's sick. They don't provide me with a single nice kitchen mat. For what? No. These rugs are killing me, man. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, you know what? Never mind. It's fine. What do we want to do dining table wise here? Because you know what? They're only going to need two seats. I'm totally not going to be here. So I can just go with a pretty small dining table, I think. And I doubt they'll be having anybody over considering that they only seem to want to hang out with each other. So we can be pretty generous here. And by generous, I mean extremely not generous with the space. A light blue. Does that look weird? Yeah. Where are my chairs? Bring me thy chairs. Bring me thy chairs sounds like a system of a down song. Actually, what if I did it like this? No, I hate that actually. We're just gonna keep it the way it was. I can't make up my goddamn mind ever. I feel like I am just programmed in indecision. There was no way I was supposed to persevere for like more than six years, but here I am, so fuck you. I feel like I'm being targeted right now, probably by the two of them. They designed this game. Happy Home Paradise was their doing, unfortunately. You ever think about that? Okay, that doesn't work either. What about this? Hey God, it's me, what did I do? Maybe it would be a better idea if I did this. You know what? We're, we're trying to make a bay window here, if you haven't already noticed that. But, uh, I don't seem to be very good at doing such a thing. I'll be back. 
I'm not kidding you when I tell you this took me an extra hour to finish because I'm so goddamn indecisive. I could not get shit to look good, but I feel like I finally got it how I deserve it. I mean, how they deserve it. And I will show you what I did real quick before we move on. I finished the breakfast nook. It looks like shit. I added a stargazing and star observing area for Ione because you know what? She deserves it. I hate to say it. She does. She looked so excited when I put it in. Phoebe, I know you wouldn't give it to her, so I'm going to do it myself. That's the bottom floor. I just needed something that would wrap it up nicely and make it feel sectioned off and I don't think I did a good job of that but whatever. I have been filming for three hours already. I need to keep going. I need to finish this. I'm giving these two people way too much credit, I think, actually. You know what? They're not gonna care. I am doing this for me. I did it for me. I liked it. I was good at it. You know what I mean? Walter White style. So my plan with this is going to be hopefully do separate areas for Ione and Phoebe so that they can both have their own little hobbies because I know their hobbies quite well. I bought them most of the stuff that they have, so I will know exactly where it goes. It's gonna be fine. Everything is gonna look so good. Don't you worry. Everything's gonna look fine. Ignore that there's going to be windows. Ignore this. Just just pretend you do not see it, all right? We need to start with a bedroom. I don't know what we're going to look like bedroom-wise. I feel like a shared space for them would be pretty minimal. We're just going to go with what we've seen before, you know? Why don't I have more beds? This is a problem. Y'all took my beds, didn't you? You took my fucking beds? That's sick. You took them from me? The only thing I had left? The only thing I had brought with me my whole life? I know you two have it. I know you two have the double bed. Give me my double bed back. What did I ever fucking do to you is my question. That'll work for intents and purposes that we have today, all right? That's what you deal with because if you won't give me my fucking beds back, that's so cute but it just doesn't match. The Gemini closet because I'm a Gemini. Don't you miss having a Gemini in your house? Don't you miss being like horrified all the time? I would. Personally, I enjoy being horrified by Geminis and Aries and stuff. That's my favorite favorite thing in the entire world, so I would really miss it. I would think it would be an awful existence to just be there without any kind of horrific creature in your house. Or, you know, you live with Phoebe, so who knows. I feel like that's kind of similar to their tastes, but it looks kind of ugly like that. Ew. This might be a little too big, actually. The anger is growing inside of me. I can feel it. It's not really cool. It's not really great. It's not the best I felt in my life, to be honest with you. I would like to fix it. If that's too small for the bathroom, I'll fix it later, all right? We're dealing with this the old-fashioned way. Where's a cute nightstand? I feel like a nightstand is the most important thing you can have in your room. The amount of shit that lives on my nightstand is insane. I feel like I need everything at night. I'm gonna wake up at 3 a.m. and suddenly I'm going to need a littlest pet shop from when I was four. Did y'all used to try and eat your littlest pet shops when you were little? Because I always did. I wanted to chew on those motherfuckers so bad, but I chewed on shit until I was way too old to be chewing on shit. And that's the real meaning of Christmas. You should be chewing on shit until it falls apart. I don't care if it's edible. It's the only place that you can get happiness in this day and age, to be quite honest with you. What if I did white? What if I incorporated some white into it? Because I want this to be lighter. This needs to be brighter if I want to do what I'm doing with Ioni, you know? It needs to have some softness to it. But all we have is white wood. Ugh. White wood is not the same thing as white. Get that through your little head, all right? White wood is very different. This is a very different thing we're talking about here. Two different things are happening at this time in this place, and you are not looking at either of them. Why did it just keep going? Fine, those will be your dressers. No dressers for you. You're going to dresser jail, by the way. A little mirror there would help, wouldn't it? A little fucking mirror, just a silly little mirror, a little elegant mirror in the corner. That would be helpful, right? Would that save me? Would that be the savior of the broken, the beaten, and the damned? Stop. Why do they all turn to look at me like that when I close out, when I exit out? I'm done. I've had it. You all just want me to fail. You're waiting for me to fail. I don't like that. I don't think that's funny. I don't think it's funny that you're sitting here waiting for me to fail. You remember this shirt, Phoebe? Do you remember it? Did you miss it at all? Did you ever think about Colin to come get it back? Or not really? You didn't really miss it? Right. Well, you can have it back. You didn't care enough about it to come get it, so I've just been hanging on to it, and I feel like it's time it finally comes back to you. You know, just on center display. Have fun with that. I don't like the two nightstands. Y'all are gonna have to deal with one nightstand, all right? You can share. It doesn't look good. I'm not a fan of it. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I literally don't know what I'm doing. That's the problem. I just figured it out. I don't know what I'm doing. I just need to find some more things to put on the walls. I don't have that many things to put on the walls. No, the walls. What did I just say? Did I say the floor? Absolutely, I did not. I don't know, I might have. I never remember what I say. That's a fun thing about me. No fucking clue. You could read back my own will to me that I spent hours working on, wouldn't know. 
know, would not have an idea. I just really want to work on their little personal areas. That's it. That's the problem. And they're just not letting me because they need to have a bedroom, I guess, which is stupid. Who the hell sleeps anymore? Not me. Just a little reminder of Ioni right there with the stars, you know? I'm going to make myself sad, actually, is what I'm going to do. I've decided it. We'll do where Ioni is currently studying astronomy for the pendant. Maybe even a little, little map up here. Would that be cute? Would that be stupid? Maybe a map on the other side, actually. That might be better. Let's do these cute little shelves, too. Why not? Nobody can stop me is the problem. That's really the problem with most of what I do. Nobody can fucking stop me. I could have written My Immortal and nobody would know about it. That's the best part. Have y'all seen, like, I feel like there's been such a resurgence in My Immortal shit lately, which makes my little heart happy. I'm a My Immortal bitch, okay? Anything My Immortal is very important to me. And the resurgence of My Immortal, very extremely important to me. I need everybody to understand that I'm going to be so annoying if y'all start bringing it back. You need to really think about this before you decide to. What do you all think of the new Paramore song? I will be quite honest, I'm not a fan. I'm not a big fan of it, I don't think. It's not that I don't want to like it, it's- it's- I really do want to like it, but I think it's just- something about it is not my favorite. I would like to hear your opinions on it, though. If you love it, why? That's not in a rude way, but just, I'm curious. What about it is, like, drawing you in here? I would honestly like to know, because I'm confused. I don't know. I love Hayley Williams' voice so much, though. Hayley Williams is one of the best vocalists, like, ever in pop punk, in my opinion. She's everything to me. Hayley Williams, if you're out there, hey. I'm just gonna move on from this bedroom space. It's fucking me up, dude. It's fucking me up. I need to work on their small little spaces, or I'm gonna go insane. I'm gonna go wacko right now. I want to make Ioni a little gaming area, because her house is a little gamer girl space. I never even redid it because it was so perfectly her, and I miss it. I've learned lately that problems do not solve themselves, which is sad. I wish a problem would solve itself. I'm tired of solving problems. I think that's dumb. I don't want to do that anymore, so I won't. If anybody has a problem, I'm going to let it sit there and faster, okay? Great plan, everybody. We're really winning here. Why did I make this space so fucking small? It's fine. The Pixar desk lamp was so scary to me as a child. I just thought he was like in the army. I don't know why. I feel like something about him was so army. Like I thought he was gonna tell me to drop and give him 20. It was really scary. I didn't like Pixar movies for that reason. I didn't like going and see the little Pixar lamp jump around. It was too much for me. I think it just all comes with what you value in life, you know? I really did not value standing lamps and I never will. I will never give any value to a standing lamp fuck standing lamps. All right, I want a little funny lamp. I want a tiny lamp, not a standing lamp. That thing looks like it has murderous intentions. Speaking of murderous intentions, I tried to play <laughs> Creature Street, which is an Animal Crossing knockoff. You might have seen memes of it before. I tried to play it because I was going to do it for a video on this YouTube channel right here, this one, this exact one. You know, there are some things you cannot play on YouTube due to the content of them. I was a little bit slightly shocked because of how many times the word penis appeared. I just thought it was too many. It was too many times. I was really walking on thin ice. I almost finished recording it and I scrapped it. Because, you know, I would kind of like to make money from the work I do. I was deeply surprised. You know, you never think you're going to see the word boner and penis in an Animal Crossing game until you do. How do you even go on after that? What was I supposed to do? There was nothing I was supposed to do, right? That's just how it is now. We need, like, one more thing. Maybe a hanging planter just for some greenery. I don't know what I'm saying. I feel like when I'm masking at all times, I'm just trying to imitate the people who run Magnolia Farms. I forget their name. Chip and Christina. I feel like I'm trying to figure that out. That's the only thing I want to be in my life. That's like peak human to me. Desirable form, in my opinion. I don't know. I say most desirable form. Like, that is the sexiest specimen on this earth. I don't know. I don't know. If you find Chip and is that even their names? I don't know. If you find the fixer upper bitch is hot, that's not my problem. That's literally not. Like, dude, that, you do you. I'm not gonna be mad at you for that. This video is a mess. This is, like, the mess video. This is where I finally out myself as a mess, and I'm fairly certain I've already done that, but, like, this time it's for real. Just, like, proving it. Just making sure you know. Making sure you're fully aware. I like to be completely transparent. What can go here? Something needs to section this off a little bit better, you know? Just, like, I want the same amount of distance between rooms as distance from me and my emotions right now. You know, you get what I mean? New plan. New plan of action here. I'm gonna move on and then I'll come back to this because I don't, this isn't working. Where's bathroom shit? Where are the appliances? I need a bathroom appliance at this time. Do y'all have your washing machine in the bathroom or in like a laundry room? I've heard such conflicting things from people. Some people say that their washing machine is just straight up in the kitchen, which worries me. Why is it in there? 
I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't do the tub. I don't know if we have enough room for a tub. I guess we'll see. This is a studio apartment, okay? They're living in New York right now. This is peak real estate in New York, by the way. Is that a full space? I think that's a full space, so a shower could go there. See? Thoughts we're thinking today. Mama, let's research. Wait, no. Oh, no. Oh. I've been given zero choice at this point, okay? I'm doing my best. I really am. It's fine. Studio apartments are in. No, they're not. Nobody wants to live in a fucking studio apartment, but you know what? That's what we can all afford at this point. So this is just, we're being realistic. Everybody wants to rule the world, but we only have a paycheck of like $20 under what should be minimum wage, so we have to deal with this. Where's the normal toilet? Great, thank you. Why is it so hard to get a normal toilet in this economy? Really, it's that sick of a world we live in? There's no normal toilet? toilets. Where are you gonna shit? You're gonna shit in this thing? That is a plastic thing you got from the container store in 2003. I don't think so. None of this is sitting right with me. Like, this is so wrong. Do y'all have a single bath mat in this home? A single one? A single fucking bath mat? I don't want a kitchen mat, I want a bath mat. I want a mat that you put your feet on after you get out of the bath. Do you know what that is? Have you ever thought about it before? Feeling cold and alone at this time? That's not white though. That looks so dirty and dingy compared to everything else, you know? They're looking at me. You know what? They're looking at me and they're judging me. Can you believe it? They are judging me in front of my children. My children that like you can't see, but they're totally here. They are judging me in front of them. Can you believe that? Have you ever thought of doing something so heinous in your life? No, you haven't because you're a good person, I would assume. I think I've almost got it. I think we've almost done it, my friends. I think we're finally at a point in time where I can say that we have done this. The bathroom, I mean. The rest of it? Hell. Jail. No, don't even bring that up to me. I'm gonna cry. I will cry right now in front of you. Then what? That's literally the vanity I've been looking for this whole time. Actually, I kind of feel like if I did that and then I just moved this over here, you'd be able to see the shower a little bit better so it wouldn't look so broken up and blocked. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Fried out the wazoo. All right, great. I think it's time for Phoebe's little music room, which was actually what I based her original house off of. So you know what? It'll be great. I remember exactly how to do this because I put so much work into researching it actually, figured out the exact type of amp she would need, really just put my heart and soul into it. So so I'm gonna bring that out again and, you know, give that back to her because I'm sure that every single time she played that guitar, she thought of me. I'd really like to know if she's, you know, improved at all because sometimes it sounded a little scratchy. I'm fine. I'm normal. This is healing and cathartic for me. This needs to be switched around. It feels like you're walking in on something. I don't know. Why is it so hard to flip these things around? I feel like I'm playing Jenga every two seconds. Imagine you're pissing and your girlfriend is just like sitting there with a PA speaker ramming it out. I think this is it. I think we really did it. I think we made my two exes a house together and they're gonna leave me alone. So this is goodbye. This is see you later. See you never. This is see you in hell, actually. And I did because your old house was hell, Phoebe. Oh, 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 is it finished? Is it done yet, Sparky? It's ready. You're a rock star, like sold out, instantly jam-packed stadium rock star. Let's check it out. No, that was you. Never really knew how to play music like you did. And I know you wanted me to. I know you tried to teach me constantly and I never got it. And I'm sorry about that, but it's not me. I'll pick a new name. Nice. Ha, huh, yeah, I seriously like that. I'm over it. Rad. Yeah. Great. Is everybody happy? Did we do a good job? Is everybody happy with the results here? All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to be normal now, and I'm never going to talk about or speak about these people again, and I will be so normal from now on. Thank you for watching me do this. I appreciate you being here. Let me know, have you ever bought an Easy Bake Oven for $180, and what the hell if you did? Yeah, it's good. It's really good. It's good. Thank you for watching. Stay safe. Stay wonderful. See you next time. Goodbye. I'm over it.